Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to the channel. My name is Tony. This is the 15 Minute Gamer and today we are back in Terraria and I'll be showing you how to mod this game with the help of T Mod Loader. I'll be showing you how to install and use this in a quick and easy guide. Not going to take much of your time because it's very straightforward. Before we start, don't forget to hit that like button comment and subscribe to the channel right so modern terraria has been made super easy by this one thing all you gotta do is head into steam go to your search bar at the top type in t mod loader just like that click on there it'll open the screen up go down to where it says install t mod loader and click install once it's ran through its installation process it'll be on your desktop or you can launch it from inside Steam by going to your library at the top, type in Tmod Loader, and there it is. You can see I'm running at the moment. All you do is click on it and click run, or go on your desktop and click the icon. So now that it's installed, what I want you to do is open it up. Once you do, it'll look something like this. So now that you've opened up the Tmod Loader, you'll see two new things, which is Mod and Mod Browser. Mods shows you what mods you have installed, Mod Browser lets you search mods. So all you do is click on Mod Browser, type in what you're looking for. So we'll type in, say, Vein Miner. It's one of the mods I recommend you download. There you go. You can see it's brought it straight up. You can press the question mark for more information. and It'll just tell you what you need to do, some details, any buttons you might need. Click Download. It'll do that. We'll click back just to show you how it works. Once you're back to this screen, click Mods. And there you go, you can see it's enabled. If you want to disable it, just click on there and it will disable. Click back on to enable. And again, you can see there more information. If your mod has settings, click on the little cog. And there you go, you can turn things on, off and change offset settings and all that sort of thing. So you can disable or enable. You can have a look through your mods by clicking the search. You can disable all or enable all. Or reload them all if one is kind of playing up and then you can see these little icons will kind of tell you what's included 24 mounts 39 walls 225 tiles 225 npcs you can see there's mod ridge from the mod browser and just tells you where you got it from and that's as easy as that once you've done that just click on single player, start your game as you normally would, and all the mods will load in. I hope you found that guide easy. I've tried to make it as easy as possible because, to be fair, it is pretty straightforward. Catch you guys on the next one. Goodbye.